So here I am in Singapore, and uh, I'm trying to get to Junk Island. It's a place kind of over in that direction, the direction the camera's facing. As far as I can tell, no one's been there before. I mean, people have been there, they just haven't been on land, maybe? Uh, and it seems, that seems impossible. It seems like someone must have been there at some point. Uh, but it's surrounded by cliffs. It's, uh, there's no landing jetty. It's surrounded by a reef. So it's pretty inaccessible. Uh, I've gotten permission from the government to go there, and I'm just trying to hire a boat. Getting on board the boat now. Just swam Pao Zhong. Here I am on the beach. There is the boat, not very far away. And uh, there's the island. I'll attempt to climb it. Well, that was interesting. Uh, went up this way and uh, dead ended into solid brush. I figured I wasn't going to plow my way through there. It looks like there are spiders and stuff, so. I'm going to try a different way around, maybe somewhere with more trees. Aha! That looks promising. There we go. Seems like really thick, spongy, probably detritus from years and years of leaf fall. Well, the trees are an excellent handhold and foothold. Much easier. I've reached a summit, or at least more of a summit. Doesn't look to be inhabited by anything. Don't see any signs of tracks or nests. It looks to be a standing stone over here. Let's go check it out. Termite mound, baby. I'm not going to disturb it. But, that's my guess. So, termites. Makes sense. I'm gonna head back along the crest of the hill here. Feet in the ground, scare off the snakes. Uh, ground here is very soft. Very spongy. Probably two, three, Five centimeters, maybe five centimeters of detritus. Oh, there's a tree that's 
fallen. Looks like it's eaten by termites. And uh, maybe some of them there, I don't know. Maybe they're ants. I can't tell the difference. So I'm videotaping it. Another termite nest. Give it a wide berth. Way up here. Maybe blown by the wind. I'm gonna head up to the very peak. Looks like this is about as high as it gets. And then head on the ridge across the other side. I think the uh, I think the termites might be the main inhabitant of this island. Bird droppings. No birds come here. Saw one flying earlier. Looks like an old termite mound, or maybe an old tree. Yeah, probably an old tree. See the roots there. Some new growth. Gorgeous. And there it is, the other side of the island. This is the reef side. You might be able to see. So that looks like the whole ridge. So I landed at 420. It's now 455. It's been here about 40 minutes. Managed to survey the ridge of the island. Um, thinking about climbing down carefully and then going around the outside rim, lower edge, and uh, taking video of that too. But looks like that's pretty much the whole island. Plants, uh, spiders, and termites. Distance, which is fine by me. All right, I need my hands, so I'm going to put the camera away. Climb down with both hands. Well, made it down. There I am. Easy descent now. Just gonna take a short break. Uh, I didn't find any signs of a human inhabitant before. No fire pits, no tools, no paths. Just got a spider bite here and then my knee. Hopefully my knee doesn't swell up. evidence that this island is built on an intrusive igneous foundation. You can see it's kind of brown. Looks like iron rich. This whole island's probably made of iron. Ah, there we go. It's 
signs of human habitation. Graffiti. Oh, rope. Interesting. Someone has been here before. Here we are. Back where we started. Crab trap. Faithful boat. All right. I'm going to pack up and head out before my nerve fails me and or I uh, pass out from dehydration. But there you go. Hello, Zhong. Beautiful little island. I wouldn't suggest going here. It's hot, miserable, and there's nothing to see. But if you're interested in the wildlife or the plants or uh, stuff that lives there, now there's this video. goes. So that was it. Back to civilization. i put my shoes on again. At your own risk indeed.